So we were driving along the road and we saw this grey ibis with what looked like a big earthworm in its mouth. We stopped to take a look and the ibis actually dropped this earthworm and we found out it's actually a Bromini blind snake. The scientific name is this over here and it's such a cute little blind snake found here in South Africa. It's non-venomous and as you can see it has some blood over on its mouth. I hope it will be okay because the ibis did catch it so it should burrow back in the ground and live a happy long life. If I remember correctly these actually do not eat rodents. They are too small for that so they'll eat insects and slugs and stuff like that that is found in the ground. So an awesome awesome finding of this cute little snake. He's just wanting to burrow back so we'll let him go back to his business and he's not a stiletto snake you would easily see the difference I'll insert a picture of a stiletto snake and this guy and you can see the difference between them let's get him back into the soil let me rather put him on this side of the little rubber bank Something else I wanted to add about this snake is it's called the flower pot snake. Brahminus is actually in its Latin name. This snake is an all-female self-fertilizing species that lays two to six eggs. So very, very tiny eggs and they generally eat small little insects. And the snake got its name flower pot snake because it gets transported in nursery pot plants, hence its common name. This is actually an invasive species which I didn't know at the time once I had caught it. It's originally from Asia but has been introduced first to Cape Town uh, roughly about a hundred or so years ago. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate you watching this video. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see more amazing content from me. Cheers, Bryce from Righteous Reptiles.